All right, now <clears throat> y'all already know who it is. Ooh, let me hide that part of the pill. Oh, D. Yes, honey. C O D J E O T T E A D E E. Hey y'all, welcome back to the podcast. It's episode one of season two of Just T All D. Finally, bitch, we are back with a whole brand new season of Just T All D. I am your host and creator of this nationally syndicated podcast TV show, Just T All D. So you already know what it is. Yeah. I talk about accolades, beauty, gossip, news, all of the things, girl, that you want to know. Every, pretty much everything in entertainment. And I just get my little you know, gay ass take on the damn shit. And speaking of gay, happy pride, everybody. Yeah. Ooh, y'all gonna read me in the comments on the fan, but it doesn't matter. But anyway, happy pride, everybody. Yes. I'm an ally. If you couldn't tell, I'm an ally. Um, Happy pride, everybody. Love wins. Be yourself. That's it. Period. But anyway, um, this episode is a little bit different. Um, I'm going to talk about some tea or whatever. But like I, okay, let me just let me just start off the season like this. You will be newsflash. That's going to be you're going to be hearing that all the the entire season. I'm sorry, I'm being real, and I'm going to address it now. Hold on. I am addressing it now, head on, that that beat buzzer, you will be hearing that the entire season. That's not going to stop me from what I'm doing. Um, I don't want to start it off on bad news um, because it's obviously, it's, you know, the elephant in the room. Unfortunately, it's all, it's all in the blogs. Two days ago, unfortunately, Jackie O popular YouTuber, also a Wild and Out cast member, and clearly, obviously, the partner of DC Young Fly. Unfortunately, Jackie O, 32, unfortunately did pass away due to cosmetic procedures after having the procedures. Um, we here, me here at Just T.L.D. Production, um, I definitely want to send my condolences in um, love, strength, and support to DC and his family during this difficult time. Um, I'm pretty sure um, he doesn't even have the words to get on social media right now. So let's all give him respect. Um, of course, you know, celebrities are going to pay their condolences and their respect to um, the actor um, and his family. So, of course, you know, you're going to see you know, celebrities making posts and things of that nature, you know, just really just giving them their love because, you know, she had, they had three kids together. And I remember when they had their first child together. So it's very extremely sad to see, you know, him go through that. And it's very sad. Like, and it, and it leads, I'm not, and I, I don't want to, I want to, I don't want to do this. I don't want to play devil's advocate, but it, 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 it's, this is, I don't, I'm not judging her and I'm not talking about her. I don't want nobody coming for me in the comments. I mean, this with all due respect. And she had a mommy makeover. Basically from the streets and the blogs, it was the complications or afterwards. Uh, word on the street was it was a heart related issue. Um, I don't know if it was given the same issue with Kanye's West mom when they were having multiple surgeries. It's giving multiple surgeries allegedly at one time or having this done and then turn around and <clears throat> get the other situ get the other procedure done. Um, you know, she had three kids and she wanted to get it. And she an all right and by all means had every right to get it. Um, so definitely I'm not shaming her on that. 
Um, I always thought that she was pretty prior to her getting those surgeries. Um, I never, you know, but like I said, I'm not a woman. Well, I'm not a biological woman and I'm not her. And I, you know, the beauty standards are tough these days. If you don't look a certain way or whatever, you know, you get canceled or whatever. But in her case, it wasn't even about that. It was just a simple mommy makeover. And, you know, when you're a mom, you have multiple kids your breasts start sagging, you want to lift them up. If you got the coins, go ahead and get it. Your stomach sagging, you got the coins, you didn't have multiple children, and you you know, you want to snap back and go back outside, go ahead and get it cut up, you know, tuck it away or whatever. But it's just like, just know that you are beautiful. You don't have to get all of that. You can just be you and own it in the mirror, and that's it. But once again, it's two different things. This was a mommy thing, but I definitely want to send my condolences once again to his family. Um, losing somebody is definitely difficult. Um, me personally, well, I'm not even going to get into that. I'm see, ooh, child, let me go ahead and just get off that topic. Look, in other news, in other news, in other news, Nicki Minaj is coming out with some music. Yes, the queen. I don't even really know, well, once again, I don't know if they gonna y'all gonna come for me on this. No, I am not a diehard Nicki fan. Yes, we are both Sagittarius, but I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm older now. Um, but I'm not that. Rah, 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 rah. I'm not all of that. I can't like maybe like doing drag performances or whatever. But like me, regular like me on a regular day, I don't wear a pink wig and I don't attack people that don't like Nicki Minaj. Like I'm not that type of person. No shade, but. I'm just saying. But anyway, Nicki Minaj is coming out with a new Studio Fit album. The Queen, um, that's what y'all call her. You know what? Let me call her the artist because that's what she is. The only queen there is is me and the only king there is is God. Okay? Thank you. Hot. Thank you. Thank you. Now back to what I was saying. So, she's coming out with a new album October 20th this year. So you girls are going to have to wait towards the winter, summer, spring, fall to bump the new track, which is rightfully so because by the time her birthday comes out in December, it'll be about two months and all the girls will have definitely remember all of her songs. I'm sure she's going to have a two. I'm sure she's going to have a tour or something out. Um, like I, I, I'm, I'm definitely seeing it, but I don't know because Beyonce is right. Beyonce is out right now, but I don't know. You girls will take. I mean, you girls will pay for three thousand dollars for Beyonce. You'll pay another three thousand for Nicki Minaj. So, congratulations and kudos to Nicki Minaj. And speaking of new music, um, uh, well, it's like new music esque. Summer Walker, girl. Um, Soft Clear is out or clear or such oh, we're not doing this this year we're not doing this this season um summer i don't i'm i did not like this one i'm sorry i don't know it's not like over it or still over it like i'm sorry those are her her two two best two of her best albums but speaking of her i was literally watching a i was literally watching um carisha please with summer walker and she did have a good valid point she was like none of y'all she basically said her fans are not her friends and she don't make music for y'all she don't give a fuck what y'all got to say she gonna do music her way and her way is the way that she is doing it now so i'm just like okay bitch i kind of felt some type of way but when i'm feeling some type of way i'm definitely gonna bump summer walker so i definitely didn't take it i definitely took it and then i wrote it down then i threw it away so anyway uh, in other news housewives of atlanta is going on the girls is coming for marlo um I can't say that I did not see it coming. Um, I don't know. Like, I'm actually getting kind of... I'm not getting tired of Housewives. Um, I just really wish that Phaedra was back. I really wish that Phaedra was back. Um, this season is definitely given kind of... The first episode definitely gave. Courtney did her thing. And then it's like... I just feel like it's only center, centered around Candy, Kenya, and then... Just really those two, really those two. Oh, then it's Sheree. I forgot, Sheree. The three main, um, I'm sorry, honey. I can't even do, I can't even, I can't even do the, um, 
I wouldn't say, well, I'm not going to say that because I don't want to get copyrighted by her. Um, but um, I can't even do the reviews because I'm like, uh, I like the show, but I, I'm, it's just missing that. It's just missing that just that oomph. It's just missing what it used to give back in the day. Back in the day, um, you know, even with, with, I mean, season eight without naming. Okay, because I know people like in the comments like to say, well, you're only saying that because of Nene or whatever. What? No. Nene leaks. She started Housewives, but I mean, obviously she left the season. She left a couple of seasons and they were doing just fine. So um, I don't even think it's that. I think it's just a, the formula. Y'all need to change it around. Um, cut it out. Y'all need to uh, reduce, reuse some people from the past. Um, speaking of past and things of that nature, Kim Zosiak is trying to get back on Housewives. It's very convenient. She done divorced Croy after about 11, 10 years of marriage. Um, I don't know what that's about. I mean, we will be seeing her on the upcoming season of Housewives. So, I mean, I don't know. That's why you can't... That's why you got to be careful how you do people, honey, because now... I, now she don't need Bravo. Now she needs Bravo. It's giving Nene Lakes. I'm sorry I'm playing devil's advocate, but it's definitely giving Nene Lakes. You cannot do people any old type of fashion way and then expect them to come back when you're ready. That's not how it works. That's not how it works. That's not how life works. You have to, you know what? Let me hush. But anyway, now she wants to come back to the show. So allegedly she's begging to be on Ultimate Girls Trip. Um, season five because season four is already wrapped or currently filming still so she definitely won't be on season four of ultimate girls trip but maybe season five has a slot for her if andy decides to bring her or not bring her back on the housewives of atlanta and road around the street they're trying to get portia to come back on there because we you know phaedra the door is closed with her because she is now on married to medicine so Phaedra can stay over there. Candy can really go. I'm tired of seeing her. I mean, she, I mean, I'm hate to see it. Marlo is kind of, well, you know what? You know, let me not do that because I actually like Candy. I like Candy's work ethic. I like her work ethic. As far as personality goes, I mean, everybody can't be like extra or whatever. You have to have different people. Like there's different types of bosses. You have crazy bosses. You have... Proper bosses, you have gay bosses, you have extra bosses, you have, I mean, there's just different types. So her turning up could be completely different than my version of turning up. I'm not saying that um, I don't like her or whatever, but I mean, as far as entertainment goes, like if I wanted to be messy and listen to some drama, basically, because that's what we listen, that's why we watch it. Unfortunately, I'm keeping it 100. That's why we watch it. Um, I'm going to choose somebody else other than Candy as far as watching. But she does bring things to the show. She brings, she's a staple, just like Nene or any other OG housewife. There's a staple. Once you start been there from the beginning or been there continuously amongst all of the housewives, honey, you are iconic. You are rightfully iconic in your own way. So... Yes. So that is truly all of the time that I have. Um, this season is going to be great. There may be a guest star or two that you may see. It may not be. I don't know. Y'all know I like to start. Last season, I started off in boy drag. This season, I'm starting it off in drag. So... <sighs> you girls and guys already know where to find me. Desi T. Divine with three N's because I am what? Extra.com. Follow me on YouTube. Follow me on TikTok. And follow me on Instagram. Those three platforms where you can see the doll. I make skits. I do it all. Okay? So, with that being said, honey... Comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you girls and guys for episode two, okay? For episode two. Baby, this look, though. Hey, it's giving regal titties. Regal rich titties. Hey. Yes, you girls can't hate me. You girls can't hate me. All right, but anyway, 
All right, you guys, bye, and I'm gonna see you next time. I'm Desi T. Devine with three N's and I am out. What kind of man are you? Ooh. Yes.